All right, YouTube, what is going on, guys? David Hammond, beautiful Mother Nature, and today in this forest talk, we are speaking of inspiration, or lack thereof, right? What do you do when you have no inspiration? Inspiration being this drive, this urge to create things, whether that be videos, photos, your drawing stuff, it really doesn't matter. It's when, when you lack this inspiration to do anything, you just it's just that you feel like you don't want to do anything. You don't want to make any videos. You have no video ideas. You have nothing that's inspiring you to make something, if that makes sense. Like, you just, you have, again, you have no drive. There's no urge. There's no incentive to, like, create. You're just stagnant, right? I deal with this. We all deal with this. Um, so what do you do, right? So this is what I've been doing. And this is kind of my take on dealing with inspiration and not having some at times because it's inevitable right the first thing is to stop what you're doing right the first thing is to stop looking for inspiration should I say I'm sorry if you guys hear a guy cutting down a tree over there or something but the first thing is to stop looking for it don't try to search for this don't try to force it because nothing's gonna happen no idea is forced ideas just come to you right very spontaneously that's why they always say stuff like you know your best ideas come in the shower or whatever that is to you for me it's the forest but anyways what I'd recommend doing is completely avoid trying to figure that thing out, trying to find that inspiration, and just go do something else, whatever that means, bro. If that means you like playing video games, cool. If that means you like watching YouTube videos, you like going on hikes, like whatever that is, go for it and do that. Because in doing that, when your mind's not so forced on focused or focused on creating something it has to do, when it's more open and free flowing, that's when things just come hit you, right? So as an example, a lot of, okay, I'm walking away from that because that guy sounds super loud. Okay, so as an example with me, it was lacking inspiration, so I was like, yo, screw it, let's go to Tobemore, let's just go adventuring, I'm not going to try to think of creating a video, but let's just go out, drive out there, go back to a beach, right, you guys saw the vlog, it was at Sobble Falls on the way back, and the only thing I had with me was the GoPro to film underwater. Boom! A video idea, how to make, you know, B-roll or film with a GoPro, like, it's all these things like that that just come to you because you're doing things, right? Another really good quote, or a really good quote by Gary Vee was, uh, you know, that really resonated with me was, document, don't create, meaning, go do cool shit, go do stuff, and just document that. Don't try to, I think what he meant by it is don't try to, cre like, don't force yourself to try to create something that's not there. It's the same thing with inspiration, like, don't force inspiration to come, don't try to create something that's not there. Go do stuff and just document it let it come hit you as the time goes on I went to go film with the GoPro boom let me document how to make a video on this maybe I'm gonna go with somewhere else I have a you know a problem with my camera boom how to document that boom how to like so that's kind of what I'm saying is um you know what's really helped me with uh, making these videos and the whole that's the whole basis on how I make these forest talk videos how I make the tutorials it's not that I so much sit down and try to like really really come up with an idea and try to force an idea force inspiration it's I just go do random stuff and when problems arise I document it I say oh you know I was at this place right here and these two lenses really really helped me holy crap I'm so happy I brought them the only two lenses I recommend bringing but there's a video idea you know all things like that just come with me all these videos man and that's why you guys see me make these vlogs where I'm going out and doing things because in turn of doing that I have all these ideas to document to you guys they work hand in hand so if you're a creator I would strong if you're a youtuber I'd strongly recommend go out and just do stuff make vlogs go explore some crazy place do something completely out of the norm to get your mind out of forcing things to happen you know what I mean if you're an artist if you draw I don't know man maybe go to like a cliff and go cliff jumping or something I have no clue and then as you hit the water you'll before you hit the water you'll think in your mind oh my gosh this beautiful drawing you know what I mean like just uh, don't force that's kind of what I'm saying so again I'm um, not the forest talk videos aren't so much me explaining what to do I never want to explain what to do it's they're more just kind of talks you know they're like ideas that uh, can be resourceful to you guys, that can help you guys, or maybe they won't. If they don't, then, you know, don't listen to them. But, um, yeah, that's it. So, it's kind of the whole video. Beautiful Mother Nature. Beautiful overcast, though. You know, sorry for those sun streaks on my face in the other videos. But, yeah, I want to thank you guys for watching. If you guys did like it or it helped, give it a thumbs up. And if you're new, my name's David. I do videos all on photography, videography, and the outdoors, obviously, right? So, that's it, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Much love. Peace.